Have you ever wondered why the Earth shakes or why we have mountains and ocean trenches? Welcome to the fascinating world of tectonic plates and Earth's crust. Our planet isn't just a silent, static sphere, but a dynamic, ever-changing canvas. This is all due to the activity of tectonic plates, the enormous puzzle pieces that make up the Earth's crust. Now, these plates aren't just glued down and static. No, they're constantly moving. It's not a race, though. Their pace is slower than that of a snail. But despite the sluggish speed, this movement has a huge impact on our globe. It's the force behind the rise of majestic mountains, the creation of deep ocean trenches, and even the occasional trembling of the earth beneath our feet. So next time you're standing on solid ground, remember, it's not as still as you think. The movement of tectonic plates shapes our world in more ways than one might think. So, what causes these massive plates to move across the Earth's surface? Let's dive a little deeper into the mechanics of plate tectonics. Imagine the Earth as a giant simmering pot of soup. The heat from the stove, or in Earth's case, the heat from its core, causes the soup to bubble and churn. This is just like how heat from the Earth's core causes convection currents in the mantle, the thick layer of hot flowing rock beneath the Earth's crust. These currents act like giant conveyor belts, moving the tectonic plates across the Earth's surface. These plates, which make up the Earth's crust, aren't all one piece, but rather a puzzle of about 12 large pieces and many smaller ones. And just like puzzle pieces, they can move and interact in different ways. This leads us to the three types of plate boundaries, convergent, divergent, and transform. First up, convergent boundaries. This is where two plates collide. The result? Well, when an oceanic plate collides with a continental plate, the denser oceanic plate is forced under the continental plate in a process called subduction. This can create deep ocean trenches and as the subducted plate melts, it can lead to volcanic activity. Next, we have divergent boundaries. Here, two plates move away from each other. As they separate, magma rises from the mantle to fill the gap, creating new crust. This process, known as seafloor spreading, is why we have mid-ocean ridges. Finally, there's transform boundaries. These are places where plates slide past each other. This motion can cause earthquakes, as the moving plates can get stuck and then suddenly release, sending shock waves through the earth. It's a complex process, but these movements are what create the diverse landscapes we see on our planet. From towering mountain ranges to deep sea trenches, from bubbling volcanoes to shaking earthquakes, the constant dance of plate tectonics shapes and reshapes our world. Remember, the Earth is always in motion, even if we can't feel it. What happens when these colossal tectonic plates interact with each other? Well, when tectonic plates move, they don't do so in isolation. They interact with each other in a variety of ways, creating different types of boundaries. These interactions result in various geographical features and can even lead to natural disasters. Imagine two tectonic plates moving towards each other. This type of interaction is known as a convergent boundary. When two plates of equal density converge, they push against each other, causing the land to buckle and fold. Over millions of years, this continuous pushing can create towering mountain ranges like the Himalayas, the highest peaks on our planet. Now picture two plates moving apart. This is called a divergent boundary. When this happens under the ocean, magma from the Earth's mantle rises to fill the gap, solidifying to form new crust. This process creates mid-ocean ridges, the longest mountain range in the world, most of which lies beneath the ocean's surface. On land, divergent boundaries can lead to the formation of rift valleys, like the East African Rift Valley. But what happens when a boundary isn't so clear-cut? When plates slide past each other, they form what's known as a transform boundary. These boundaries don't produce spectacular mountains or deep ocean trenches, but they are notorious for causing earthquakes. As the plates grind against each other, they can get stuck. When the pressure becomes too much, they suddenly slip, releasing energy in the form of an earthquake. Volcanic activity is another common result of tectonic plate movement. This usually occurs at convergent boundaries where one plate gets forced under another in a process called subduction. The subducted plate melts in the mantle, and the molten rock can rise to the surface, forming a volcano. 
Each of these interactions plays a crucial role in shaping our planet's landscape. They create the diverse geographical features we see today and influence where and how often natural disasters occur. From the tallest mountains to the deepest ocean trenches, tectonic plate movement truly shapes our world. But how do these tectonic movements affect us and the world we live in? Well, in a myriad of ways. Plate tectonics plays a crucial role in shaping our environment and influencing life on Earth. For example, tectonic activity is responsible for the creation of mountain ranges and ocean basins, creating diverse habitats that foster a wide array of life forms. Moreover, when plates shift and collide, they can expose mineral resources, providing us with essential materials like copper, gold, and oil. However, these movements aren't always beneficial. They can also trigger natural disasters like earthquakes, tsunamis, and volcanic eruptions, causing significant damage and loss of life. But the influence of plate tectonics extends even further. Over millions of years, the shifting of these plates has separated and isolated species, leading to the evolution of new species. This has resulted in the rich biodiversity we see today. Tectonic plate movement is not just a geological phenomenon. It has profound implications for life on Earth. Let's revisit what we've learned about tectonic plates and their impact on Earth's structure. We kicked things off by delving into the Earth's moving crust, introducing the concept of tectonic plates. These pieces of the Earth's outer shell float on the semi-fluid layer beneath, moving in response to the heat currents rising from the Earth's core. Next, we dove into the mechanics of plate tectonics, understanding how these plates move and interact, causing earthquakes, creating mountains, and forming new landmasses. We also explored the results of plate movement, highlighting how these shifts remodel our planet's surface over millions of years. And lastly, we touched on the impact of plate tectonics on life. From the evolution of species to the shaping of our climate, these moving plates play a significant role in life as we know it. So next time you look at a mountain or feel the ground shake, remember it's all because of the incredible power of moving tectonic plates.